The Christmas season brings so much joy, but decorating can sometimes feel overwhelming. You want your home to feel festive, warm, and welcoming, but it's easy to go overboard or make small mistakes that make the space feel cluttered or chaotic. To help you create the perfect holiday vibe, here are 10 common Christmas decor mistakes, along with simple fixes to keep your home looking beautiful and balanced all season long. Holiday decorating mistake number one is overloading every surface with decorations. The mistake is filling every available surface with Christmas decor like figurines, candles, and knickknacks, which can make a room feel crowded and chaotic rather than festive and inviting. The fix for this mistake is to choose a few key areas to highlight instead. Focusing on high impact areas like your mantle, coffee table, or entryway allows your favorite holiday pieces to stand out. Leaving some breathing room keeps your decor feeling intentional and uncluttered. Holiday decorating mistake number two is using too many colors at once. Mixing too many colors can make your decor look mismatched and busy, especially if your regular decor is already colorful. The fix for this mistake is to select a cohesive color palette that complements your existing home decor, sticking to two or three main colors, like classic red and green, or soft metallics and whites, or in my case, warm, cozy neutrals. This creates a harmonious look that feels festive without clashing. Neutral decor pieces like candles and garlands can also help tie everything together. The third holiday decorating mistake is getting a cheap fake tree. While an affordable option, a low quality fake tree can look less than lush and may not hold up well year after year, leading to more waste and replacement costs over time. The fix is to invest in a high quality artificial tree that will last for years. Look for a full realistic tree with hinged branches for easy setup and storage. While it may cost more up front, a durable lifelike tree provides a beautiful foundation for your ornaments and lights and saves you time and money in the long run. Our last tree before this one lasted us probably 15 or 20 years before we had to replace it. The fourth holiday decorating mistake is cords and power bars everywhere. Visible cords and power strips can detract from your beautiful holiday decor and create a tripping hazard. Take a few moments to tuck away cords and use cable ties or organizers to keep everything neat and tidy. For areas with lots of lights, discrete power strips and cord covers can minimize visible wires. These small details keep your decor looking polished and professional. Are you ready to transform your home but not sure where to start? Join me for my free class, Embrace Your Space, where I'll share my proven process for creating a home you love to live in. In this workshop type class, you'll learn the exact steps I've used for years to turn cluttered chaos into beautiful, organized areas in my home. I'm also going to teach you my foundational steps to loving the home you live in, including my secret for loving your home as it is right now, even if it's nowhere near being your dream home. Don't miss out on this opportunity to start your journey toward a home that reflects your style and feels like you. Sign up for the free class today at homemadelovely.com forward slash embrace your space YT. That's homemadelovely.com, embrace your space YT, all one word, and take the first step toward creating the home you truly love to live in. The fifth holiday decorating mistake is using too many breakables. Decorating with lots of fragile items, especially within reach of kids or pets, can lead to accidental breakage and added stress. The fix for this mistake is to choose sturdy, unbreakable items, especially for lower surfaces, saving any delicate decorations for higher up spots. Consider soft decor pieces, if you have little kids especially, like plush figurines, fabric garlands, or shatterproof ornaments, to add style without worry. This keeps your holiday setup family friendly and stress free. The sixth holiday or Christmas decorating mistake is mismatched decorating styles. Decorating in a style that clashes with your home's everyday look can make your Christmas decor 
feel out of place. To fix this mistake or prevent it from happening, choose holiday decor that complements your home's existing style. For example, if your home is modern and minimalist, a simple understated holiday setup will fit right in. For more traditional or rustic spaces, embrace warm colors and classic elements. This approach creates a cohesive look that feels like a natural extension of your home. The seventh holiday or Christmas decorating mistake is neglecting scent or home fragrance. While technically not decor, scent is a huge part of the holiday atmosphere and can easily be overlooked. The fix for this is to add a festive scent to your space with candles, essential oils, or stovetop potpourri. I love creating a simple simmer pot with ingredients like cinnamon, cloves, and oranges. Make sure you check out my blog post and my other YouTube video for ideas and recipes and how to make a simmer pot of your own. These cozy fragrances complete the holiday experience, making your home feel even more inviting and holiday-like. The eighth Holiday or Christmas decorating mistake is ignoring scale and proportion. Decorating with items that are all the same size or filling a small space with oversized decor can make your holiday setup feel off balance or overwhelming. The same is true if you choose the wrong height Christmas tree for the ceilings in your house. The fix for this is to mix up the sizes and shapes of your decor pieces to create visual interest. For example, if you're styling a mantle, place a larger item like a wreath or a tall candle holder in the center and add smaller accents on either side. Think of the rule of triangles that I teach too. Balancing big and small items helps make your decor look thoughtfully styled and put together. And always measure carefully for your Christmas tree to include the base and the star on the top. The ninth holiday or Christmas decorating mistake is forgetting about functionality. Placing large decorations in high traffic areas or putting breakable items within reach of little ones can make daily life a bit trickier, especially in a busy home during the holidays. The fix for this is to think about how your family uses each space before decorating it. Keep delicate items up high and avoid putting decor where it might get in the way. For areas like the coffee table, consider using soft or unbreakable items that add warmth without adding stress. The 10th holiday Christmas decorating mistake is forgetting to add natural elements. Using only artificial or mass-produced items can make your decor feel a bit flat or impersonal, especially if you're craving that cozy, organic holiday vibe. The fix is to incorporate natural elements like fresh greenery, pine cones, or even a bowl of seasonal fruit. These touches instantly add warmth and texture to your space and help create a more inviting, relaxed atmosphere. Natural elements are also an easy and budget-friendly way to enhance your holiday decor. Decorating for Christmas should be a joyful and stress-free experience. By avoiding these 10 common mistakes, you can create a warm, balanced, and beautiful holiday home that truly feels like home for the holidays. Enjoy making your space merry and bright this season. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe down below so you don't miss any of my future videos focused on creating a space you love. Space, space.